now you know which Hi, I'm Taranosaurus and uh, I taught the two poi one hand aka superhero poi class and um, we started off with the superman which is sort of the foundation of all of your two poi one hand moves. Um, so it looks like this, this is a two beat superman. Um, we talked about two different ways in to the two beat superman. So we talked about starting with holding your thumb side poi and letting the pinky side poi swing. And then your two, this is a split time move, so your two poi heads are never on the same side of your body at the same time. So when your poi is on the way back, you can just drop it in on the other side. And then we also talked about this where you can do the same thing with your top hand. So your thumb side is making a two beat weave, then you let go of the bottom side and let it swing. Okay. Ready, let's do that together. Um, from here, we talked about the X-Men, which is, um, it's a bounce move. So I tend to start here with the poi resting on your upper arms and you punch out, flip your hand over, and bring it back in. Um, to note here, your thumb side poi is always on the top, your pinky side poi is always on the bottom. Your palm is facing up when your hand is up here. Your palm is facing down when it's here. So every, every punch, your hand changes which way your palm is facing. So up, down, up, down. And this can actually be done on like any part of your body. <laughs> kind of play with that. Um, the next thing that we talked about was, um, oh, we talked about the one-handed butterfly and uh, how to get into that. So we started with a pendulum, holding your thumb side poi, and then when you're here, you tip and bounce. Use like your, uh, use your extra hand to bounce your pinky side poi down so you can kind of like force yourself into the move. So you're here, here, One-handed butterfly. And this, um, here you're also kind of doing a similar thing to what you were doing with the X-Men. Um, we paid attention to the fact that the X-Men is half of a floor plane butterfly. So here, here, and then it's the same movement when you're going. The next thing that we talked about is, um, I actually don't know the name of this, but it's a Superman, it's a between the legs Superman. Uh, so here, here. So what's happening if we break this down, we're starting with our thumb side poi on our upper arm, our pinky side poi dangling. And instead, when you do your Superman, you let your thumb side poi cross over. Instead what we're going to do is instead of letting it go over to your hip, we're going to just let it go between your legs. So that's going to stay there. This, your pinky side, is going to come up and rest here on your forearm. And then you're going to let this swing out. And while that's swinging out, you're going to swing the pinky side back through your legs. Thumb side comes out. Pinky side comes out, thumb side goes down. And that's that. And from here, we can do uh, the Fantastic Four, which is basically the same as the Between the Legs Superman that we just did, except now what's happening is, instead of resting the toy here, we're gonna let it go up and through, and then in, and then this is gonna come up, and then through, and then in. So what that looks like, I'll sped up, is. Uh, yeah, and that's the Superman. So that was like the basic material that we went over in the class. Um, we also talked about a few other things. Um, we talked about the fact that Supermans can also be done as a reel. So your thumb side is in a reel instead of in, in wheel plane. Um, this can be interesting once you start wanting to learn three poi to, to change planes here. 
Um, also, we talked about a four beat Superman, where you're doing two beats on each side. This is a more advanced move. So to break down the timing on that, um, you're doing one beat when the bottom poi is here, and you're doing the second beat when the bottom poi is here. So. Um, for more advanced uh, movers, maybe you can do like... So my pinky side poi is touching my back on the second beat. Um, and I think that's everything we went over. So uh, if I think of anything else, I will add to the class. But that was it. Thanks. So your prop has a 